a good crowd of Republicans like this. So uh, I think we all know that this nation faces a crisis. And as the chief of staff for the president says, we hate to put a good crisis to waste. Of course, the crisis, as you and I know it, is called the Barack Obama administration. That is the crisis that this nation faces because he will bankrupt this nation and he will place such debt on our children and our grandchildren that they will never pay it off. So it's important to have someone in the auditor's office who is a fiscal hawk, who has a proven track record of conservative fiscal principles. And you may or may not know this, but my Democrat opponent actually campaigned for Barack Obama during his primary. So apparently she likes the idea of bigger government, higher taxes, and less freedom. Recently, I decided that I want to continue to serve in the public arena and keep my, my principles and your principles, those of conservative government and limited government, in place. Now, the question that you'll ask is, well, Alan, why are you the best candidate? Well, allow me to give you three reasons. The first is, I have served in Missouri House for the past seven years, the past four years as chairman of the House Budget Committee. So I have a proven conservative record when it comes to budgeting because I know the money comes from you. It does not come from state government or the federal government. I have voted for tax cuts and against tax increases. So I have the record to prove that. Secondly, I am not new to the Republican Party. I have been in local politics and actually grassroots for almost 20 years doing simple things like putting up yard signs, talking to my neighbors and church members about who to vote for, handing out lit pieces at, at the polls. And of course, I've moved up since then to Chairman of the House Budget Committee. In fact, this last cycle in 2008, I was able to raise almost $300,000 to give to other members of the House to keep the Missouri House in Republican hands. So I've worked very hard to ensure that. And the final point I want to make is that I have been, actually this is really something of an honor, 80 of my House colleagues have endorsed me for the auditor's, auditor's position. They have seen me in action. And in fact, every member of the Republican House in the 7th Congressional District has endorsed me for auditor, and I really, truly consider that to be a great privilege. And I would ask you, obviously, I need help. The statewide race, as we all know, is tough. As Tom said, down ticket is even tougher. We need to send Roy Blunt to Congress to stop Robin Carnahan and her fiscal irresponsibility that she'll foist on us. And we also need to have that fiscal hawk, that conservative fiscal person in the auditor's office. And I am that person based on my record, based on what my colleagues see in me. And I would like to continue to be that watchdog over the executive branch and every branch of government because it is your money, it's taxpayers' money. As I often say, my favorite phrase is, in God we trust, everyone else is subject to audit. Thank you for your support.